Tonight we're hearing from Colleen, a Colleen homeowner who shot and killed a suspect who police say broke into his home. Fox 44's Kendall Green spoke to the man who says he had to make a choice. It was his life or the intruders. Vividly, the 20 year army veteran remembers the morning when a young man broke into his home suspecting no one was there. He says it all started with a loud knock at the door. He was knocking and ringing incessantly as if he lived here and got locked out. So that was, that, that hurt me a little bit. So I looked and then when I looked through the people, he began to talk. I thought to myself, this guy should be in school. What's he doing here? You know, either in high school or college or something. He says he was checking to see if he would get a response. And when he didn't, he says he walked around the back door and banged on it as well. The resident says he then realized what was happening and he quickly went into defense mode to protect himself. I went to my to the little drawer, pulled out the gun, and I only had seconds, 10 seconds or less, to position myself. And as soon as I was positioned, I pulled the hammer back and the door blew open. He describes the quiet moment just before chaos erupted. Like the calm before the storm, like the eye of the hurricane. It lasted about two, three seconds. I said he was casing the joint before he came in. And then suddenly he walked in. And the minute I saw him walk in, that's when I opened fire and all hell broke loose. The homeowner says he fired at the young man several times before he ran off in an attempt to escape. I had like three or four shots left. I, le I let him go. And right before he jumped up or over the fence, I think I hit him because when he went over, I heard him grunt. The veteran says he doesn't like that his home was broken into, but out of all of his neighbors, he says he had the least to lose. I can only imagine what would have happened if it would have been another residence, because I'm the only one here in this area who lives alone. Everybody, everyone else has children, little ones, loved ones, and he came to the right house at the right time. And tonight he's hoping the incident sends a clear message to home intruders, especially in his area. Uh, don't do it. Think twice. Leave us alone. Because if you're 18 years old, I mean, you've got a lot of years ahead of you. A long time. And to be killed for coveting something that doesn't belong to you is not worth it.